Welcome back to Summer Gems channel. It's been two weeks, I know. I've been out away from playing the computer, so let's go back to Elm Lake. And Shh, baby, just another nightmare. Everything's fine. You dozed off. Right. Anything more than dozed off would be news for everyone. Cheer up, handsome. We're here. Who's this person? Okay, we're a little bit better on frames this time. Okay, it's been a while since I played Alan Wake. As you know, I've been gone for two weeks. Oh. Let's act like we're on vacation. Go stand next to that old gentleman there. I want a shot of you with the town in the background. Okay, I'll do that in a minute. Sure. I'll even give you a title for the shot. A city boy. Moments before he got eaten by a bear. <laughs> um. Let's see, I believe there's a collectible up here. I've played a little bit into this. Uh, Go up there. It's the other side, I believe, that has the collectible. <laughs> I've heard that as Um, th so this video isn't going to be very content ranch, no killing. I don't think. Probably a little bit of a nuisance. But it's got some story into it, I know. Okay, so let's do it now. Before he missed the shot. Oh, yeah. I, I didn't realize this was being uh, it's lagging, but I've got a few more frames than I did the other day, playing offline. This is a little gentleman. Hello there. You picked a good time to visit our town. Deerfest is just two weeks away. Mmm, Deerfest. Deerfest. Huh? Did you hear that, honey? You have a lovely wife, if you don't mind me saying. I'm Pat Main, by the way. Nice to meet you. Pat Main. Yeah, I'm Alan Wake. I won't pretend I don't recognize a famous writer such as yourself, Mr. Wake. A pleasure. I'm an avid reader myself. I hope this isn't too presumptuous of me, but I'm the night host at the local radio station. Any chance I could get an interview? Look, Mr. Main, I'm on vacation. In fact, I'd appreciate it if we could keep my being here just between the two of us. I'm sure you understand. Fair enough. You can trust me to be discreet. Not a hard man to track down if you change your mind, though. I hope you two have a lovely holiday. Okay. So, we're getting ready to get in. We'll go to the diner. Spoilers, not really. I mean, that's right where we're going right after the ferry. This is when I was looking for collectibles. I didn't find one, though. Well, if I did, I collected it already. See, there's our car. Looks a little weird. It's, uh... Looks like some, like, rub sand all over the back. Okay, but, um... Okay, I I've been needing to tell this for a while. I am going to bring back the Pokemon Black and White walkthroughs. And if you haven't watched them yet, you can. Um, but... I mean, I don't blame you if you don't want to watch a 20-30 minute video, but I need to bring those back as well. Um, there's some. Okay, it's going to be another week or two before I'll get another video. This video out. You guys will probably be seeing this tomorrow on Thursday, but this is Wednesday. I just got back. Um, so tomorrow's the going to be the fourth. So sorry, sorry for the inconvenience, guys, on this stuff. I've been trying, I've been trying to get this stuff better, but I mean, it's better to be actually be doing a video than just playing. Because I was getting ready to play one of the Minecraft mod packs on Technic Launcher, as you guys know, but I ended up not doing it, and I'm like I should get this out of the way. <sighs> Trying to think of something we'll talk about. 
but I mean this is a nice game it, uh, I mean no matter what I'm going to do it's going to have low frames but at least they're doing much better better in offline I get a few more frames emphasis on few already halfway through the video I was just about to speed up I would pause a bit if I do that I'll end up having the video edited and I don't like video editing I don't have a really good one I have a trial for 60 days which you might have seen Vizrax use he was the one that told me to use it it's a trial version I'm not paying a thousand dollars to use it yes so um, I'm I don't tell you what it is because well I'm not being mean but you could probably message Vizrax I'll have a link to his channel in the description because he's a pretty cool guy he he puts a lot of time into his videos he's the stop-motion bionicle dude Alan looks like he doesn't give a crap on I me. Mean, just look at him, he's just like, mm, mm, nothing cool here. Okay, wow, this is like taking forever. I remember it taking a lot. Oh, did he? T or maybe she told us to get Very back in the car. Nice. I got a couple of really good ones. And I see oh. Your friend. That's you. Right. Oh man, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I forgot I could have just like skipped this all. Oh. Yeah. Very. Yeah. We just got here. Are the locals giving you trouble? Just say the word and I'll hop on a plane and come make sure that you're left alone, Al. No, Barry, we're fine. Great. Great. Just want to make sure you can relax and recharge. So, how is the place? Has it gotten your creative juices flowing? Barry, we're just settling in. Okay, Al. I'll call back later to make sure you're doing okay. And you call me if there's a problem, okay? Okay. Just looking out for you, buddy. Talk to you later. I love you too, Barry. Okay, there isn't going to be too much content in this video. I'm taking you know up a lot of time. Going to be calling you every five minutes. Barry is Barry. Okay, I'm not trying to make be mean to anyone at Barry. That name is Barry, but I mean, in most games, if, you, if the character's name is Barry, they're kind of a sidekick. So, I'm not trying to be mean Alan, in any way, but on, I mean. Like in Pokemon Diamond Pearl and stuff. Yeah, see, I could have sped that up so much and not wasted time, but need to stop at the local diner that's my fault. I'm sorry, guys. Mr. Just gotta have the. He's waiting for us. Stucky, that's a creepy name. I'll go fill her up while you get the key. Isn't it? You up here in, say, 15 minutes? Sure. Okay. Um, I might edit this video, make it a little longer, Alan, in 10 minutes. Um, I so. Love you too. Go on. I'll promise to be. Yeah, I'll probably cut right after this cutscene, start a new recording, edit it together. Places like this. Maybe. I don't know. Towns where everybody knew everybody. Yeah. Welcome I will. to the Odier Diner. Hi, I was wondering if you could help me. I'm looking Mr. for Wake. Alan, Wake. Oh, okay, she does look creepy. I didn't notice that before, but I mean like I all the time, but I really She looks kinda like she was getting ready to show me. <laughs> I'm gonna stop talking over I'm it. I'm looking for Mr. Stucky. Carl Stucky? Carl? Of course, Mr. Wake. He must have gone to visit the restroom. He'll be back in a moment. <laughs> he was like, eh. Okay. I can't believe it. I've got all your books. Okay, just hold on a minute. Oh, shoot. Okay, back after a small break. Okay, back to it. I got the cut up from the he's talking. Oh my gosh, not now. Of course, at this time. And to keep it here. Well, okay. Good for you. I'm just going to ignore it. Okay, over on that cart there would be a collectible item or a collected a favor, of course. Sonny. I can really use a tune right now. Coconut number six in the jukebox. Okay, buddy. I do it myself, but both of my legs have gone to sleep. Bad yeah. circulation. Yeah. Uh it's one of those old timey things, see? I was going to be playing a really doofy song. I really hope my friend doesn't like Skype me Are again. Are you serious? So. Coconut again? You disgust me. Call yourself a rocker. Unbelievable. Ha! Okay, if I go back to Sheriff, you'll tell me who they are. Yeah, you need to give it a good solid whack. Oh. Whoops. 
I forgot about that. Um, I'm trying to speed this through this. I'm sorry. Um, you can use the juice you box. The lime in the coconut. Drink them both up. Just because the lime in the coconut and drink them both up. You in your sleep. Uh, okay. It's really easy to do. I just screwed that up. <laughs> Probably the easiest thing in this entire game, and I've screwed it up. Coconut. Now that's what I'm talking about. Yes. This is it. I've died and gone. Poor old guy. Who's this lady? She's holding an old-time lantern. Don't go in there, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. I think I can handle it, ma'am. Oh. In any game that's worse. I wanted to find Stucky to get the key and get out as soon as possible. But this look horrific, like doesn't it? This is always how fans always bad games start. Like, the bad thing happens. <sighs> Nothing. Okay. Let's go in there. Okay, after this cutscene, I'll cut off. Or no, I won't. Yeah, I will. Don't know how long I'm recording. Mr. Right Stucky? Carl couldn't make it. Unfortunately, he was taken ill. But I have the key for you and instructions on how to get to the Creepy old lady here giving okay. me stuff. I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. And to meet your wife. I insist. Thanks. She looks like the like the evil wedding gown lady. I know she just looks kind of old, kind of. Oh, I don't know. Uh, uh. Cauldron Lake is a special place, very inspiring. Okay, seems lady. Ooh, big swordfish. You got lucky this time, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. Well, if I couldn't see anything, I probably would have chipped over my own feet. Fixed. And then I must remind Sarah to change the lights at the station. It's been too long already. Uh, okay. I'm gonna try to get to the car without getting trapped. <laughs> Even that sounds better than your singing. Are you alright? Okay. That's funny. The Andersons, they're, uh, local musicians. We're waiting for Dr. Hartman to come pick them up. They wandered off from his clinic at the Cauldron Lake Lodge. Okay, well, see you later, Mr. Sheriff. So, we're just b playing babysitter. Okay, well, thank you for watching. And, what? Wait for part four. Well, my wife's come to pick me up. You'll have to see where she's taking me next time. Bye!